The man who claimed responsibility for the shooting death of a 17-year-old in Dayton is now backing out of his plea deal. LaShonda Childs was killed back in October after police say Trendell Goodwin shot her in the head. Two News reporter Judith Bratana has the new information, though, we learned today in court. Trendell Goodwin took back his plea of guilty this morning just moments before he was set to be sentenced, elongating the process for both families involved. LaShonda Childs was gunned down in October, just days before her 18th birthday. Before she was shot, the 17-year-old had obtained a restraining order and referenced a series of abusive encounters involving Trendle Goodwin on her Facebook page. On Wednesday, Goodwin wrote a letter to Judge Atkins saying he wanted to take back his guilty plea on murder charges. Goodwin's deal for a shorter sentence could be off the table if he makes an official motion to plead not guilty and go to trial. And the court's commitment to you that it would be 18 to life is gone at that point in time. I just want you to be aware of that. Goodwin telling Judge Atkins he didn't understand what he was agreeing to when he pled guilty on Monday. He's not telling me if I understand something, look at him. If I did something. Judge Atkins agreed to allow Goodwin to fire his attorney and bring on a new one to look into the matter. Some of the rules about attorney-client privilege are gone at that point in time. Not all of them, but some of them. That lawyer will have to file an official motion with the court to plead not guilty. A hearing would then follow. Goodwin is scheduled to be back in Judge Atkins' courtroom a week from today. We'll keep you updated with any court proceedings. In Dayton, Judith Ratana, 2 News, working for you.